All right, so what is going on everyone? Swan here and today uh, we're gonna be playing some head-to-head -head because we didn't do a lot of head-to-head -head last season um, and the, the season just ended so it's a new season and hold on let me just show you the rewards real quick it says you haven't played a game this season I'm ranked 650 they put me in the 650 bracket these rewards are absolutely crazy so the wild card which I already have I get uh, 88 overall breakout I think Sean Green and then all you have to do to get to the division series, you get 92 overall Rod Carew for the Twins, which is a crazy card, diamond hardware legend. You get to the championship series, which I got to the last, er, I got to in last season just easy. You get 99 Eric Gagne, which I already got 97 Eric Gagne from Battle Royale and sold it for like 100 or 90k or something. So, I don't know, I don't even know if I want that card. But then, the World Series division, you get 99 overall breakout Ralph Kiner, which is gonna be crazy. The hitting stats are ridiculous. It's like the it's like the Andre Dawson stats, like not quite Ted Williams, but you know, compared to those type of people, like the uh, Miguel Cabrera from the last season, it's absolutely crazy. But we're actually gonna do a little bit. We're gonna add someone to our team, which I have enough stubs to buy these are all earned stubs like that I've gotten in game haven't spent a dime on this with actual money so figured I'm gonna spend it and I'm just gonna do it right here I'm getting El Tuve well I already got El Tuve now but hold on did I start recording I hope it did okay good I was gonna say I hope I didn't just talk to myself doing nothing um, but anyways, now I'm down to 36,000 stubs. I, I got a lot of stubs at some point, like, you know, selling a bunch of people from Battle Royale rewards and stuff like that. But, oh, a part in this team, I was doing some Impact Veteran stuff, trying to get the Hanley Ramirez card. But, anyways, well, I'm gonna make my lineup and show you just what it's gonna look like now. Okay, well, this is the new squad. We got Curtis Grand, actually, the only, I'm not even gonna read off all of them. The only thing that's changed is I put in Altuve from, or for Daniel Murphy, put Daniel Murphy on the bench. We got two diamonds on the bench now, which is pretty solid. And then all of, all of these guys are diamonds over here. Um, and then, yeah, we got Altuve hitting the two spot. And that's gonna be so fun. Just look at this card, it's so awesome. I absolutely love Altuve, so this is gonna be super fun. But anyways, let's get into a game. All right, looks like we found ourselves an opponent. He's got Tony Gwynn, Lorenzo Cain, Victor Martinez, Daniel Murphy, Orlando Cepeda. I don't really like that Cepeda card. Alex Gordon, Mike Schmidt, Justin Turner. I don't really, I don't really like his team all that much. I'm kind of pissed that I have Catfish Hunter pitching. I need to get him out of my rotation. I only have him in because he's a diamond. Um, but maybe I should put a gold in there. Maybe I should just get like Dallas Keuchel for like, he's like 9k and he's a diamond also. And he's probably a lot better than Catfish Hunter. But anyways, this guy's 2-1. Los Angeles Scorpions, Dodger Stadium we're playing at. And it looks like we are the away team. And hold up, Jesus, why is everything all messed up now? Okay, we gotta go back to the strike zone view. Oh shoot, I gotta change one thing too. Started on pure analog, just started pitching on pure analog. I actually love it. It's kind of nice to do. But anyways, we got Granderson up, and let's go. First pitch of the game. Why did I do that? At least it's foul. Jesus, I forgot his his changeup is pretty slow and drops a lot, so I don't, I don't know. I don't like that. But anyways, throws a slider inside. Come on, let's get a good start to Granderson. Get him on base. Have El Tuve hit him in or something. Ooh, I should have poked that out to left field because they play a huge shift on Granderson. It's really weird. But anyways, let's go. Curveball. Not gonna chase that. Three and one already. Let's see if he's gonna walk me. He's probably gonna walk me. He is. Curveball or change up low. And now here we go. First at bat with El Tuve. Jose, let's go. And that's a base hit. Let's go. That's such a good start to having this card. I absolutely love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Let's go, Altuve. I, I can already tell this is going to be a good, good season to to play in. But anyways, here we go. We got Griffey. He's going to throw me low again. This guy is absolutely crazy. Here we go. Come on. Give me something to hit. Give me something to rock. That was not a strike. I mean, technically it is. It did catch the plate, but whatever. Ooh, is that deep? Is that deep? Is he going yard? 
No, he's. Oh shoot! Wait, wait, wait! What, what the? Okay, what's going on? Why is it so laggy? Okay, whatever. I'll just keep Griffey at first, I guess. Uh, he dropped it, and Granderson scored from second. But anyways, that, that was really laggy. I hit that really well though. That should have been a home run, I think. And I am just chasing. Not good. Let's go, Goldschmidt. Oh shoot. Give me that RBI. Give me that RBI though. Let's go. He's not going to turn two on that. That's solid. Sacrifice. Oh shoot. Popped up. That's going to be three outs. Or is that two outs? That's two outs, isn't it? Never mind. Now we got Victor Martinez up. And Victor gets a base hit. We're going to have Goldschmidt go to third. Because his uh, outfielders are playing. Martinez very deep. All right, let's go. Let's go, Arenado. Oh, Arenado pops up. He jammed me a little bit. All right, let's show. I'm sure if you've played this game, you probably know what pure analog is like. It's it's kind of it's a lot different than anything else. We're gonna toss him with the curveball, see if he chases, and he doesn't. Hit him with that slider. I'll show this first whole first at bat to start, and looks like we're gonna get a little ground out to Altuve. Perfect. There we go. A good start, a good start. There we go. The best, one of the best fielders in the game. Louis Eparicio. Louis. Louis? I think it's Louis. No, I think it's Louis. I don't know. Oh, he gets his first base hit. Dang, he got a little bloop with, uh, with Martinez. With my own guy. That's just disappointing. Oh shoot, get there! Get there! Oh no. Oh, I just left it right up the middle! Oh my gosh, it's gonna score two, isn't it? Oh my gosh, there is no way! That's when pure analog can just screw you up. It's just like, you just sometimes leave stuff right over the plate. Literally, it's, it was like two outs with like no one on, and now I just let up two runs in the bottom of the first. It's so bad. Oh my god. Come on, Griffey. There we go. That's what I'm talking about! Alright, let's go, Aparicio. Let's get a little bunt down. Oh yeah. Oh shoot. Come on, softer hands, softer hands. Is he pretty far back? Oh shoot. What am I doing? No! I wanted to check. Whatever, I'll just get a base hit. Nope. Oh shoot. Come on, 98 speed. 98 speed, get there! Nope. Not gonna do it. All right, now we got catfish, terrible pitcher up. I couldn't think of a funny word. All right, let's go. Let's go, catfish. Catfish on catfish. Watch him walk me. He's scared. He's terrified of me. No, two, two little hits to I think Justin Turner sitting at shortstop. I don't think he's a shortstop though. I'm pretty sure he's a third baseman. But anyways, we got Granderson up. Come on, stop throwing me these low. That was an 87 mile an hour two seam. Stop playing a shift on Curtis. Oh my lord, please. I hate it. I hate it so much. It is not cool to do. I hate shifts so much. There we go. Sit down. Got him with the curve, finally. Oh, that was beautiful. Oh, that was so beautiful. That was absolutely perfect. Right in that little circle. Ow. Jesus, that kind of hurt. And just perfect timing. Now we got Catfish up. Oh, shoot. No! I should have had that for sure. And now we got freaking Tony Gwynn up. Come on. Oh, another good one. Another beautiful pitch. Yes, that is my pitch. But we're going to hit him with it. He's going to get jammed and just ground out. Yep. We'll toss it over there. Oh, yeah. He's so fast and so tiny. That Louie guy, Lewis. I don't know how you pronounce it. I need to look it up. Let's go, Altuve. He's got 99 contact versus righties right now. Because he's playing up. Nah, nah. Ooh, shoot. They should up his power, honestly, to like 60 or something. I think he has like 15 home runs this year or something. Oh, no. It just, just glitched and just sat there. I, I was confused on what was going on. Anyways, we got Griffey up. Let's go. 
Oh, is that a home run? Nope. Oh, no, I would have had a triple. That just ruins it. Come on. I got jammed, had a low inside-out swing. Oh, come on, Goldschmidt. I struggle with this Goldschmidt card, man. I got it from getting the World Series Division. Like, I think it was the first time, the first round of it. And it just, I don't know. Let's go, Gwyn. Let's go. RBI, single up the middle. That's what I'm talking about. Now I think I got Victor up. Come on, hit Gwyn around the bases. God dang it! They always throw him low. It is so hard to hit with just because of that. Everyone's so careful hitting or pitching to Victor Martinez. And it's so annoying. Oh, that was perfect. That's what I'm talking about. Those like little little spots. I'm see I'm gonna I'm gonna hit this corner perfectly. I'm gonna try to. Oh, pretty close, pretty close. But man, I love this analog pitching. There we go. Perfect. That's what I'm talking about. I keep saying that, but oh my gosh, I love this. See, I'm going to do exactly what he did to me. Just throw a low changeup or a low something. Oh, shoot. I left that up. All right. There we go. There we go, Goldschmidt. He's a great fielder. It's not going to let that buy him. Oh, I left that up. Oh, I left that up. Oh, let's go, Griffey. Oh, I was going to dive. I, I was honestly about to dive and just screw that up. I didn't think he was going to get to it. But anyways, here we go. I think it's top of the fourth, and we're doing good. And Arenado pops up. Come on. There we go. There we go, Aparicio. Hold up. My brother is calling me. Hello. You already got off? Yeah. Yeah, I'd probably go. Okay. Yeah, that'd be fun. All right, peace. Well, I'm going golfing today after I upload this. Actually, I'm uploading a different video. Oh, turn two. Oh, turn two. Gunned out. Let's go. Uh, I'm gonna. I already have one video edited and uploading today. It's a pack opening. My championship series slash all star series slash bases loaded pack opening. Pretty pretty exciting stuff. But uh, and then I'm gonna. I'll probably. I probably won't edit this yet. Probably just edit this another day and just get ready to golf, and yeah, it'll be a good time. It's gonna be a good day, and it looks like Mike Schmidt's hitting a little liner down the line. Line, liner down the line, that just sounds weird. Anyways, Griffey's out there, or not Griffey, Granderson's out there in right, trying to uh, throw him out, but he's not gonna do it. He's not gonna do it. And we got Justin Turner up, I'm pretty sure he has 99 contact versus righties and a lot of power, so that's a little scary, but we'll just be sure to keep it low on him. Because it's a lot easier to keep it low doing pure analog, I'll tell you that. Oh shoot, now we're being a little too careful. Now I'm going to hit him with that high heater. That high heater. Oh shoot, I left it up, but it's going to stay in play, hopefully. Come on. Let's go. There we go, that was key. That was key. we got to hit one home run this game, too. We haven't even hit a home run yet. And it's like the fifth inning. But let's go. He's probably going to pitch me low again. Oh yeah, base hit. Get in the gap. Get in the gap. Get in the gap. Oh, okay. He pitched me. He just had a hanging curveball. But here we go. We got Altuve up again. He's one for two. Let's see what we can do. Ooh. I'm just gonna let him go. Just gonna let him go. Let's go, Granderson. There we go. Stolen base. Stolen base for Curtis. He had. He had. Yeah, inside fastball. A little tough. But anyways, here we go. Two strikes. Okay, good. That was scary. I was I sh probably should have swung. It was really close. Oh my gosh. Nope, nope. Please tell me I didn't go. Okay, good. There you go. Thank you, Ump. Two and two. It's scary. He's got a small strike zone, so it's hard. Ooh, okay. I was late on that. I was very late on that. Oh, you left it up the middle. You cannot be doing that. Oh, and he's letting it go by. Oh, get the three. Go home. That's an inside the parker. No, it's not. No, it's not. No, it's not. Would have been a bad decision, but that's a triple. It, I don't. They're not even gonna count that as an error too, because he didn't like dive at it. Didn't do like any animation. But let's go, El Tuve. He's just making moves out here. Base it up the middle turns into a triple somehow. Oh my gosh, he's two for three with a single and a triple. That that calls for uh, a cycle. 
Should I put a power swing on it next step, Ed? I might have to. While we're waiting, I'm going to make a thumbnail. Oh, that's gonna score him. That's gonna score Altuve. There we go. Solid little uh, RBI chopper to uh, the third baseman. I'll take it. Here we go. I'm gonna try and get under it now. I want to hit a home run with someone. Can't get under that. That was in the dirt. Nice little base hit. I'll take it. Well, he's just he's just holding it out there. <laughs> Heads up play, Goldschmidt. Let's go. I was sitting here. I was just looking at it. He, I was like, he never threw it in. So I just tapped L1. Made him go to second. Let's go. Oh, get out. Oh, what? Was that dropping? Oh, shoot. I left early. I thought it was going to drop. Never mind. All right, let's go, Victor. Victor Martinez. Put a power swing on it. Let's put... Oh, my gosh. That was perfect. Oh, if only I was earlier on it. Oh. No, not doesn't have enough juice. I got a little jammed. Was a little bit too late on it. Oh man, I need to hit one home run. I don't know why I can't recently. I just haven't been hitting a lot at all. Like it's been ridiculous. Oh, putting in Charlie Blackman. Okay, okay. He's a solid player. I got two of him now, and I'm just gonna wait for him to go diamond. His price to jump up, and then boom, sell him. Get like a quick 20k probably, because a lot of people already have him. But. Uh, Let's go. It's all about playing the market. I'm learning to enjoy Catfish a little bit more because his curveball is pretty nasty. It drops a lot. His changeup drops a lot, so it fools a lot of people. And his two seam isn't bad. It's pretty slow, but it's like a changeup. And that's going to be perfect. Oh, yes. There we go. Jammed him. But I don't know. He's not that bad of a pitcher. My, only, my biggest problem with him is his velocity. But. Even then, it's just not that big of a deal. But look at this two seam; like it just. Dr okay, my my camera shut off after it records for like 30 minutes straight. Shuts off, so I had to turn it back on. It was like mid sentence. But what I was saying is like his uh oh shoot, his two seam. You might have heard it. I don't know if it cut out, but his oh shoot, what is he doing? What is he doing? Oh my gosh, this guy's dumb. His two seam like drops and sinks like a sinker, or drops and cuts in like a sinker. So it's kind of nasty, but it's like a slow sinker. It's like a change sinker, like a quicker circle change. I don't know, kind of a stretch, but whatever. We got Arenado up. His his PCI is just tiny because he's playing down to 89 overall, and he's not like I don't know. His hitting is just hard in this game. Tyler Clippard's curveball is pretty nasty. He's got some, he's a pretty good pitcher in this game, and he's just gonna pop him up. Come on, Arenado. My average with Arenado is like 250, 245 maybe, I don't even know. Like, not good for this. But I'm gonna lay down a little bunt, and he just completely screwed that up. But anyways, he's like, well, he's one of the best drag bunters in the game, even though he's a righty. Trust me, I've gotten on with so many bunts. I'm just gonna steal real quick on him. Because he is so quick. Look at him. He just flies down the bases. Oh my gosh. It's amazing. Let's go catfish. Let's go. Oh, that's a base hit. Yep. That's not going to score him though. I'm not even going to try. But look at this. Here we go. Now we got Grandison up. Oh man. I'm just going to start warming someone up just in case. I got a pretty solid bullpen. I love this Nishek card. As you can look at this. I played or I pitched... I'm 6-0 with Nishek, with three saves, 0.53 ERA, lefty's average is actually worse. Oh, he quit. I made the guy quit. He was too pissed that I was, like, changing. But anyways, yeah, my left, the, the lefty average versus righty Nishek is, like, 0.5 something, and then the, or the lefty, yeah, and then the righty, righty on righty is, like, point, is, like, a 150 average or something. So... It's pretty solid, but anyways, we won our first game uh, in this new Battle Royale. Uh, we are now up to 667, which is really nothing, but uh, you know what? This new team, L2 base batting 666 for me with uh, a single and a triple, so that's kind of huge. His slugging percentage is probably pretty good already. Actually, I don't know, but uh, 
I'm going to grind this to make sure that I get to the World Series Division. I need that Kiner card. I don't really need that Ganya card. I feel like there's going to be a lot on the market, though, so I might not sell it. Actually, no. That Ganya card is nasty because it has, like, five pitches instead of four, like the breakout one. And it's just filthy. It is amazing. I'm not going to lie. Um, so I probably will use him. And I don't think there's going to be that many on the market. There might be some. But he'll probably go, I'm going to guess, around... 55, 60k, kind of like the usual uh, World Series players that get sold. But then that Rod Crew card, maybe only like 35k. Um, that Sean Green card, ugh, who cares? That's gonna be like worth probably 5k. But um, that Kiner card is probably gonna be worth like 80k. It's gonna be a pretty spendy one because I don't think a lot of people are gonna sell it. And um, I'm totally fine with that because if I get it, I'm not selling it. That card is nasty. But anyways, first game with Altuve was great. Got some new addi or got that new addition to the team, which I'm super excited about. And um, I think that's gonna be it for today. So anyways, super exciting stuff. I'm almost at the Hanley Ramirez card. I'm gonna fin I'm gonna try and finish his uh, his program because I only have one more thing to do. It's a bunch of just impact veteran stats. Uh, it's kind of annoying, kind of a hassle to do, but I might end up doing it. But anyways, yeah, thank you so much for watching. Drop a like if you guys did enjoy. I'm actually going to be, uh, I'll mention it in my next video too, because this is really random at the end. I don't know how many people are even watching at this point. But uh, I'm going to be playing Tokenasty probably sometime next week or within the next couple weeks. I, met, I talked to him on, uh, I messaged him on Twitter and stuff because we've been following each other for a long time. And I was like, hey man, we should like, record a video, you know, playing each other in Diamond Dynasty, and he said, yo, I'm down. Um, so, it's going to be super fun. I'm super excited for that, because, you know, he's, I, I watch him all the time, you know, on Diamond Dynasty, I think, or on MLB The Show, like, he's just a great guy. So, that'll be pretty fun, and I'm sure a lot of you guys know him if you watch any other MLB The Show videos, or even, like, Madden, he plays all sorts of games. But anyways, that's going to be it for today. I've said this, like, 60 times, but anyways, um, as always, I hope we're all having a nice day, and I'll see you guys later. Peace out, everyone.